when they ask, well, what does AMRO do? As someone that's not familiar with AMRO. And I'll say, well, the big orange fuel tank that we've all seen on the space shuttle, we build all the panels that make that tank. And then you build a bracket, you, you don't build all the parts. And I said, yeah, we really, truly do. We make the panels that make that tank. We are manufacturing all of the metallic components required for the uh, rocket engines that will be part of the ISL program, taking whatever goes to Mars up there. It's one of the largest rockets ever produced in the free world. The employees that we have here, most of these people have been with the company relatively forever, which forever here is 39 years. They are able to manufacture these beautiful components. It's a bump warming operation which is done by experts that we have been here for almost the entire time that Amra has been in business which is 39 years and it's an art. The fact that we support the space program uh, is just such a sense of pride. The first SLS launch is slated for late 2018 launch and that'll be an unmanned test flight uh, with an Orion crew capsule on top and the first manned flight of SLS is slated for 2022. The AMRO team is extremely close-knit company. We now have three generations working in this business and would anticipate it going on for many more years. It's extremely honoring for me to be a third generation member here at AMRO and to continue on and continue to build on the, the legacy that my grandfather and, and father have built. I'm very proud to be in a position to be a key member in our nation's space program. I'll definitely be down at the Cape in Florida and uh, watch that launch. Yeah, I, I, I can't wait for that day.